Do you have a plan? Is your day planned out? It's good to make a plan, but everything you plan will be subject to change. Or at least it would be best if it is. If you try to run your day rigidly, come hell or high water, by your plan, you will end up at the end of the day frustrated, bewildered, tired, and disappointed. Rarely does everything go the way we think it should. You have to leave room for flow, for God, for the universe, for nature, for things to play out as they're supposed to. And realize when it seems like things aren't going your way, they are going your way. That there's a higher part of you, the God part of you that can see what you can't see with your small, rational, conscious mind by judging from the evidence of your senses. You have no idea what not making that red light is going to do for you. What position it may put you in tomorrow, the next day, five years from now. Because by you not making that red light, it changed the whole course of your life. I know that's hard to understand, but it does. It changes everything that happens from that point on. You can't see the big picture, but there's a part of you that can. A part of you that knows everything. And you have to trust that. Even when it seems like things aren't going your way or as planned. There's an old expression or saying that I really like. Man plans, God laughs. As I said, though, it's good to have a plan. It's good to plan. But your plan has to be flexible. It has to be moldable, malleable to situations, circumstances, events, weather. You never know what's going to happen. But if you have a destination, just like if you take off from New York to go to L.A., you have your road planned out. You know what road you're going to take. But there may be a few detours along the way, unforeseen by you, that arise during the trip that were not there when you made your plan. You know you're going to get there, even though you have to go through these detours. Life is the same way. If you have a goal, a destination, you will get there, but these detours are not to hinder you, they are to help you. If you only choose to believe and view it in such a manner. Think about that today, when things don't seem to be going your way. It's always happening for you, not to you. Take care.